why we don't get crushed is, well, let's think about a can. Here we have a can, and the can has got 15 pounds on every square inch crushing that can, but the can has got the top open, so it's got air on the inside. So it's got 15 pounds of air pushing out in every direction. There's like a push of war going on. Not a tug of war, but there's a push of war going on inside the can. What's one thing to do when you're doing tug of war and you don't want to do the tug of war? You drop the rope, right? So let's drop the rope. Let's get rid of the pressure on one of these sides and see what happens. Well, one thing that I can do is I can remove the pressure from the inside of the can. All right? And for that, I'm going to need a volunteer. Okay? And First thing that we need to do is Prashant is going to do a dress rehearsal. There you go. Hold it over the water. Go to the can. Ready. Ready. One, two, three, go. All right. Ready. One, two, three, go. Go. Ready. One, two, three, go. Oh, you are good. You are. Hold. Release it. There we go. Let's get a little bit of water. Now I've got, there's a little bit of water in here. I left a little, just a little bit of water at the bottom of the can. There you go. Hold that up in the flame. Hold it right there. Now, it, you can see some steam coming out already. I want to get a nice chimney of steam coming out of here. Don't worry, Kishan, no pressure on you. Don't drop it. Hold it up a little higher. Okay, we got some good steam coming out. Alright, ready. One, two, three, go. Alright. Ready. One, two, three, go. Oh my god. Okay, pull it up. on this and we look at the crush patterns they are not consistent with the tongs it's crushed from every direction so what happened here is in the can we have a little bit of water at the bottom and then the rest of it is filled up with air the steam filled up the can it forced the air out so it actually kicked the air out and replaced it with steam and then when we took the can and turned it upside down a, we covered the opening with the water of the tank. No air was able to get back into the can. And the steam on the inside went from that hot steam to cold. It condensed, turned into droplets of water, which take up a lot less room. So now there's little droplets of water on the insides of the can, leaving nothing inside the can. We created a vacuum inside the can. So now we have pressure outside, 15 pounds in every square inch. No pressure on the inside. And what that did is it crushed the can. And it crushed the can, crushed the can. Under pressure. Yeah.